Hello everyone, this is Kuhu from the K Junction and today I'm here to share with you a review of a recent toy that I got. It's called a Threading Snowflake. It is from Skola Toys. So as you can see uh, about Skola, Skola Toys is a range of wooden toys that enable children to have experiences that are exciting and educational. So Skola is basically um, uh, designing a Montessori inspired toys and I must say they are doing a great job out of it because they have an experience of about 25 years in the same domain. Uh, I fell in love with uh, most of their toys uh, based on the design and the thought behind um, designing the toy. So let's quickly have a look at this particular treading snowflake toy. This is how it looks uh, the box. Uh, it says 3 plus but I think it can be used definitely can be used uh, from 2 um, years of age and also um, perhaps from like 20 or 22 months also because my son is 22 months old and uh, he, he was able to use the, this toy uh, pretty much well. So it has a, a doodle page kind of thing in the cover in the box and here you can see the details that what all areas it works on so as you can see um, it works on fine motor skills cognition and creativity which is which is definitely true uh, dexterity concentration and creativity so I like this thing about the toys um, school toys the grid it definitely mentions what all skills it work a toy works on and what ages uh, we can use the toy and a, a small write up on how you can use this uh, threading snowflake toy so just a basic about any threading toy in the market uh, threading is considered as a very very uh, effective fine motor skill and it seems simple to us adults but it is, it is very challenging for uh, toddlers and preschoolers so one threading toy or, or threading activity is I think a must in every toddler's uh, toy collection. These are some other toys from the Skola Toys collection and uh, this one I, I love it a lot. Let us open the box and see what is inside it. So this is what uh, comes inside the box. This is the threading snowflake toy, um, jumbo crayons to work on the doodles in the, on the box a small booklet with other toys in the, collect, in the collection and a pamphlet which tells more about this particular toy so let's have a look uh, so it says it is a fine motor skill and um, it says dexterity dexterity means uh, using both the hands effectively so it helps in dexterity because um, the child has to hold the snowflake in one hand and use the needle to thread inside these holes so uh, so that skill is developed writing skills um, before we give a child a pencil or a pen to actually write the letters or something we should give them a lot of pre-writing exercises so one of the pre-writing exercises is this kind of um, exercise so uh, a child uses the fingers small fingers to go up and down and to manipulate the finger muscles to do any activity so it helps in um, developing those muscles small muscles so it's called pre-writing activity as well uh, cognition um, concentration of course if you if you're you know, threading the needle uh, into all these holes you are going to do it uh, in with a lot of concentration it's the actual part of the review basically describing the toy and what I loved uh, in the toy so let me quickly uh, tell you how this is used and sorry I'm doing this uh, with just one hand uh, so you take this needle and insert it in any of the holes and then take it out insert in another hole and take it out so that's how you weave the thread by inserting the needle in any of the Holes. So you can go by step by step like this or you can insert here and then here, then here, then here, any kind of uh, pattern you want to weave. So it can be used every time you use this toy, you're going to weave a different pattern. So that's um, one creativity aspect of it. So quickly what all I loved about this toy. Uh, the first and foremost is it is very very sturdy. It is wooden 
So the thickness is uh, like this. Yes, as you can see, it is quite thick and very sturdy in design. And it is safe. The edges are not at all sharp. And um, young kids can also play it without any uh, adult intervention. It is quite safe um, that way. And they mentioned that the paints are also safe. So it can bear abuses by your toddler. The size is perfect. I mean, as you can see, this is I mean, adult hand holding this toy. And the size is perfect for those tiny hands to hold and work on it. And uh, the needle is quite long, so it doesn't frustrate the child. And it is quite sturdy also. This is also wooden. So if you're doing a DIY threading activity using a shoelace, it will have just this this much long um, needle so a child might get frustrated but with this needle there's uh, there's no chance of getting frustrated it will go inside the hole pretty quickly and without any hassle as you can see the the thread is pretty long so that means you can weave intricate designs uh, you can go from this hole to this hole directly and go come back to this hole so the thread is pretty long to support any kind of weaving pattern you want to do and the size of these holes are just appropriate again uh, not too big not too small to frustrate the little worker and according to the design I like the uh, intricate pattern over here it, it catches uh, the attention and the color is very very soothing I love the color of this uh, now let's make this threading activity a bit more challenging. So basically I want, uh, I always try to reuse a single toy in many different ways. Um, so this is, uh, once your child is, you know, expert in doing threading and all uh, using this toy, you can increase difficulty level like this. So here I have used sketch pen and, you know, written some stuff over here. So basically you can do matching activity with this toy. So as you can see, I have drawn a triangle over here and a triangle over here so the activity is to match the triangle so first your child will weave through this triangle and then weave through this triangle so you get the drill right like this similarly you can do matching of any kind so you can do matching of shapes then you can do uh, matching of numbers so uh, this is two and match the number of dots so this is two so the child will thread through this two through this hole and then through this hole and you can also do matching of uh, letters uppercase lowercase so match uh, this to a lowercase a lowercase a so this is matching activity so you can um, through this activity you can actually come up with different different weaving patterns every single time again uh, apart from matching you can use this toy for sequencing you can write as as you can see I have written one two three so sequencing would be first your child has to insert uh, the, the needle into this one and then comes two so first insert from this and from this and then from this and so on and so forth the bonus thing is that this doodle box and these jumbo crayons they are, they are like quite thick to hold just the right grip for the toddlers and you know they can color it out when they are just bored of anything and um, I like that the size of this uh, crayons, the, the grip is just perfect. And uh, I must say that this toy is equally, equally um, gripping and calming for adults also. I was like glued to it for a long time. I was weaving different patterns using this. If you like this review and if you, uh, you might want to go through the Skola Toys website and see all their collection and um, I'm sure you'll love them. And uh, if you want to have um, a discount code to buy the Skola products, you can visit my Facebook group. I will link up the Facebook group in the description box below. And you can go to that group and uh, you know grab a discount code from there and buy the Skola toys from the Skola website if you want to. And if you grab this toy, do let me know how you liked it in the comments below. And thank you for watching and do look out for uh, more such toy reviews from Skola Toys from uh, the K-Junction. Thank you, bye-bye and happy parenting.